mind if I interrupt? I was just told by the chairman that he'll be stopping by this evening. When you get back, come to the fourth floor meeting room. Oh, um, okay. I'll see you all later. Koro-chan, give me your paw. Oh, he did it! What a smart dog! Oh, hi. Koro-chan, go say hi. You can do that, right? His name's Koro-maru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. This dog still goes on walks all by himself? What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest at the Naganaki Shrine. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. That explains it. Well, until the priest passed away. He passed away? Oh, you haven't heard the story? It was about six months ago. The priest was hit by a car while walking his dog. He didn't survive. Ever since then, that dog sits patiently by the sight of the accident. And he goes for a walk every day, just like when his owner was still alive. Oh, shoot, I have to get going. My son will be back soon. Oh, you're such a loyal dog. Good boy. Huh? What's wrong? Oh, nothing. Sorry. Wait, isn't the chairman coming today? Then we should go get ready. Yeah, see you later, Korochan. Hello, everyone. I wanted to let you know how my research has been going. This concerns those shadows that have been appearing during full moons. I want you to listen closely. It might be hard to follow. Shadows can be divided into 12 categories according to their characteristics. This we've known for a while. It's like their class or order. Now, I've classified the special shadows we've seen so far, and it's simply fascinating. Those four shadows belong to categories one through four in order of their appearance. They may have looked different than the more common ones, but the classification scheme still applies. Is that something we should be excited about? Oh, I get it. There's 12 in all. Eight we haven't seen yet. That's exactly right, Fuka. You're quite sharp. Oh, uh, okay, but what are they after? That's a good question. And that's what we haven't figured out yet. Their motive. They don't kill their prey. They feed on their minds. It can be considered predation. But is it really? Is there an underlying intent behind their behavior? The purpose of the shadows as a whole that's what we need to consider. This is interesting. But no matter what, we still have to beat the rest of them. I agree. That's about all we can do at this point. Eight more, huh? Lucky us. According to the data, each one has been stronger than the last, so we better start training harder. We'll manage. We've got plenty of time. What about Tartarus? Why does it even exist?
Good evening. Are you surprised? Truth be told, we all visit this world every night. What are you saying? Who the hell are you? Didn't mommy teach you any manners? You haven't introduced yourself. Take a look. Name, address, age, etc. This is you, right? Where did you get this? Somebody's got a grudge against you, and they asked us to get revenge. Revenge? What kind of bullshit is this? Who put you up to this? Can't tell you. We're professionals. Professionals? Oh, shit. You mean the rumors on the net are true? <sighs> May we get this over with now? Hey, w wait, wait. I haven't done anything. Why me? What did I do? That is not our concern. Your notion of right and wrong is irrelevant. My client's wishes are all that matter. People hear what they choose to hear and believe what they want to believe. No! Stay away! Get away from me! You squeal most magnificently. Such raw emotion. He's not dead. Doesn't matter. We've held up our end of the bargain. Besides, tomorrow this will just seem like some random crime. If there's nothing else... I'm feeling rather tired. Hi, how are you today? Just one? I'll have what he's having. Huh? Coming right up! One house special! How can you eat the same thing all the time without getting sick of it? Shut up. You always eat that protein shit. Here you go, one house special. Be careful, it's hot. Yow, he wasn't kidding. You still haven't made up your mind? Is that what this is about? We've got four new members. Things have changed quite a bit since you left. We're more aggressive now. I'm not interested. Think about it, Shinji. Don't let your power go to waste. My power ain't worth shit. Shinji! I made up my mind a long time ago. I ain't going back. You have to let the past go. What's done is done. It's time you moved on. <laughs> you should talk. What? Face it. You're no different than me. Hey, Shinji!
sorry to bother you, Fuka. It's okay. What's on your mind? Well, um... I was hoping you could do me a favor, with your skill. I was doing some research on our school, and I came across something strange. Ten years ago, a lot of students missed school for some reason. They were reported as absent, but I found some records that suggest it was something serious. Do you know anything about it, Fuka? Me? Um, not really. I know it was a long time ago, but doesn't it seem suspicious to you? From what I've heard, this isn't the first time shadows have appeared. Wait, are you saying? I don't know, but I wonder. And I'm not trying to make trouble, but... Mitsuru Senpai acts kind of weird whenever someone asks questions about Tartarus. Does she? I just want to know what happened back then. If it doesn't have anything to do with the shadows, then fine. I understand. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Can you guess what I'm going to tell you? <laughs> You're used to it by now, huh? The next full moon will be in one week. Are you prepared? Be I'll come again. So, um, <laughs> I'm no good at this. Uh, where do I start? Um, maybe this isn't such a good idea. Still, uh, well. I had something serious to talk about. I want you to have this. I never had much I was that attached to, but I always held on to this for some reason. I used to keep my house keys on that. Thing is, I never wanted to go home. So, when it turned out I was going to get to live at the dorm, you wouldn't believe how happy I was. I thought after that, I, I could turn my back on it all. So I kept his keychain and house keys stashed away, since I figured I'd never have to use them again. But after a while, I didn't like the way I was trying to avoid stuff. I knew the problem wasn't going to go away just because I wouldn't look at it and that I was lame for ever thinking so. That's why I dug these out. I plan to go see my dad, too. Then again, <laughs> I'm still kinda chicken. If you hold on to those for me, it'll be like you've got my back for it. That way, I have the guts to see him.
Hey, listen. You can talk to me too if anything's bothering you, all right? And I'm not saying so because I want to be the guy people turn to. It's just you don't have to do everything yourself. You and the rest of the gang were there for me, and I'm here for you the same way. Don't forget that, okay? You know, I'm glad I got this power. And it's not because it makes me kind of like a superhero or anything. It always bugged me, that weakness I knew was there inside. And I feel like I can change. And I think that if it wasn't for you and the rest, I wouldn't have that feeling, even with this power. Or worse, I might have done the wrong things with it. So... Thanks. <laughs> Jeez, listen to me, going on like that. Come on, let's eat. You want some more green onion barbecued pork? <laughs> 